what is the Cinco de Mayo for? What is it? Do you know? Mexican Independence Day, right? It's the Battle of Pueblo, I think. Oh. So what's it Mexican Independence Day? Is when they we we're allowed Mexicans in? Because I heard that that's still not allowed. <laughs> according, I don't really know. I heard that that's still a little bit of troublesome in the United States. I don't know why I got more country when I was supposed to get Mexican. Yeah. Can you can you get Mexican? I can try. I can try it too. <laughs> okay, Cinco de, Ma- Cinco de Mayo holiday celebrated in parts of Mexico and the United States in honor of military victory in 1862 over the French forces of Napoleon III. Had no clue. Did you? I knew it was something about independence. Now, now white girls are just getting fucked in bars, bathrooms <laughs> with a marg in with their With a hand. corona. With a corona and a marg. I used to you have go- something on your nose. I think it's either part of a mustache or a fly. Well, that's not good. <laughs> Wait, you have something on your cheek, and it does look like a little fly, too. It's the mustache. It has to be the mustache. It's giving fly. The mustache. Yours, giving, too. You're, you have a little fly on your cheek. Can we zoom in on both of our flies? Let's see if we could get our fly on this. Hold on. Your cheek, it's on your left cheek. Let's see if we could get that fly. Zoom in on Sarah's. It does look like a little gnat. You know, what? a gnat. Does mine look like a gnat? Yeah. It does. Can you, did you see mine? Yeah. I can't see it. That's the fun part. Can That's, you see yours? This mustache is fucked, dude. I think I'm inhaling it. Snorting it? Yeah. I'm scared to drink my Red Bull. Not me. Did, you, did your guys' dads have mustaches when you were growing up? My dad, no. He had a beard at one point. Not just a mustache, ever. Yeah, my dad always had like a handlebarish mustache. Like that? A little less redneck than this. But he always had a little facial hair. Not too much, not too little. Yeah, my dad had a red beard at one point. But I remember I used to do this thing with my dad's beard when I was little. Where he used to take my hand and he'd go, itchy. No. Itchy. And then he'd go the opposite way and he'd go, scratchy. No, no. (laughs) And we called it itchy, itchy, scratchy. (gasps) <laughs> itchy, 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 scratchy. I know, that's yeah. so great. Yeah, and I would hate the scratchy part because it would kind of hurt. Look, the scratchy part does hurt. It if does you make hurt. out with a guy that Now has... I have a boyfriend and it hurts. Yeah. Does your boyfriend's facial hair hurt you? Sometimes. But then I'm also like, I am also like, if I'm in a weird mood, like it would be jarring if all of a sudden he came in fully shaven. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? No, like when you see you their can't. full face and you're just not ready for it. Gentlemen, you're like, you've been doing this facial hair thing though, since I've met you. So. Gentlemen, you can't fully facial hair shave in front of a woman and expect things to go great. You need a, you need a warning. You and like, you know warning. what? It was Put my- it in a nap. Show her what you're going to be. Oh, my God. I did the creepiest thing last night. What'd you do? Well, it was already creepy that I was doing it. I was, okay, I was with my sister and we were being insane on the couch. Like just being, like, insane Puerto Ricans. She was talking about her boyfriend. We were looking through his following. <laughs> we were Investi- being crazy. We you were guys inve- were being investigator we were reporters. Yeah, together. Reporters. It was our bonding Puerto Rican time. And and then at one point, she we co- totally switched from being investigative, being like, see, men like these whores, you know? They all, they all like these big <laughs> lift whores. They say they don't want a natural bitch, but <laughs> suddenly you look at the likes, it ain't no natural bitch ever. No. No, that's what they want. They want you to be natural so nobody looks at your ass. That's what they want. <laughs> I think you're right. I, I think, think I'm just, right, too. You just cr- cracked it. I think that's what it is. I think they go, no, 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 sweetie, you don't do that. And then they just you're, fucking, <laughs> you're, you're beautiful. Just the way you're you beautiful, are. just the way you are. And then, then why are you liking some fucking big lip Botox bitches picture? <laughs> they think it's natural too, these idiots. They do think it's natural. These idiots. When they the last, it- this was the rant me and my sister were doing last night. We were like, oh my God. Yeah, 20 of the most like posts on Instagram. Let's see. Okay. Okay. <laughs> You think they're looking at her face or looking at her tits? I mean, her tits look great there. <laughs> and juicy. she does look natural there, pretty natural. Yeah. All right, so this is, this is Selena Gomez for the— But for even the her, show. Selena Gomez has to have some work. Go up. Let's, let's, let's investigate. Up. Let's investigate. She, it looks like a little filler Definitely in the filler. lips. Definitely some filler in the lips. Definitely a little Botox uh, on Botox the forehead. Botox on the forehead. Not one wrinkle in her forehead, please. Botox in the crow's feet. Botox here. Yeah, she's got a little bit done, but this is a pretty decent one. I can't believe that's one of the most liked. It's very pretty. 
Okay, Messi, Tom Zendaya, Tom. and Tom Holland. This is pretty natural, actually. We were I'm looking, looking for bases. Fake, fake. I feel should... like this is like a curated list. Like, I, I don't know. This I... is all soccer. This is a soccer dude and his pregnant girlfriend. XXX Tenacion. XXX Tenacion. You have to say it with a French accent. XXX Tenacion. 